I don't think this is going to come as a massive surprise to anyone, but it is official now. Forma, the parent company of Morphe, have now filed for Chapter 11 bankruptcy. By the way, I got this information from Fashionista, but there's loads of articles about this online. This is relatively new news, sort of. We kind of all knew that this was coming given the very abrupt closure of the stores, the way that the employees were actually treated, being given one, two, three days notice and a maximum of about three weeks worth of severance, which was pitiful to say. But this is going to have pretty big ramifications for a lot of other brands because Forma obviously owns Morphe, but they also own Jacqueline Cosmetics. They own Playa which is currently in a bit of a lawsuit with Morphe, Lipstick Queen and Ariana Grande's R.E.M. Beauty. Now, R.E.M. Beauty recently just even announced a new release. So we'll see what's actually happening there. In this article, they go on to say that in an official statement, Forma confirmed that its assets would be acquired by a group of lenders, including Jeffrey's Finance, LLC, Cerberus Capital Management, LP, and Intermediate Holdings, LLC. Wow, like that is massive. And they were given $33 million from creditors to support business operations through the sale process. Oh, this is bad, guys. I mean, who would have seen this coming back in 2016? The article goes on to say that obviously this isn't a massive surprise to all of us because we started to see massive falls in revenue come around 2021. And of course, the major tie ins with all of those influencers, Jeffrey Starr, James Charles. I mean, so many people were embroiled in lots of controversies. Nikita Dragon. I mean, we could just go on and on. And that definitely impacted Morphe hugely. And in another article, which is actually written by Allure, they say that Ariana Grande is working towards finalising an agreement to take all operations in-house for her brand, R.E.M. Beauty. So we'll see what's actually happening there, because, I mean, they're going to have to look into development, like marketing, all of these things, because presumably Forma had been doing all of that beforehand. But this is obviously going to impact quite a few brands that have been bought up by Forma in the past one of which is, of course, Jacqueline Cosmetics. Now, she ha- actually hasn't said anything about Morphe even closing, like other than to say that it was a bit sad. So it's going to be interesting to see exactly what's going to happen to her brand here. Like she has made considerable bank from Morphe in the past. So we'll see what's happening. I mean, personally, I'm not surprised. We all saw this coming. I feel horrendous for the employees involved. Like they have been screwed over. What do you guys think?